Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Group Vice President and General Manager, Toyota Division, Dave Chris. Well, hello. How's everybody? Welcome to, well, this is Land Cruiser Heaven. Welcome. Tonight we have the unique opportunity to stand among the largest collection of Land Cruisers in the world, curated by Greg Miller and his team. Greg and his family were great Toyota dealers for years, and Greg's true passion for Land Cruiser resulted in this amazing Land Cruiser Heritage Museum in Salt Lake City. This collection has it all. Its history begins with the very first 1953 Toyota BJT that was originally designed to rival Jeep, and there are only six in the world. The collection's eras conclude at the 200 Series Land Cruiser Heritage Edition, which celebrated the last generation we sold here in the U.S. And there's a Land Cruiser for every enthusiast, including a 1958 FJ25, the first Land Cruiser sold here in America. A 2012 VDJ78, the first and only 4x4 truck that has traveled on all seven continents. We've got FJ40s, FJ60s, and FJ70s. And not one, but two mega cruisers right over there, including number 17 of 149 limited production trucks, and it's in original factory condition. I mean, is there a better place for hundreds of Land Cruiser enthusiasts to gather from all across the globe for the annual Cruiser Fest? No, there isn't. This museum is only one example of the passion and enthusiasm for Land Cruiser. And it goes without saying, that the history and heritage on display here is truly remarkable. It provides the perfect setting to launch the future. As you all know, a few years ago, we made the difficult decision to stop selling the Land Cruiser in the US, ending a 60-year run. And let's just say, we heard your feedback. We knew how passionate you were about these trucks, but wow, some of these comments really cut deep. We couldn't tell you then, but we had a plan all along. We knew Land Cruiser would return, but we wanted to do it the right way. So, are you ready? Yeah. Introducing the all new 2024 Toyota Land Cruiser. How about it? What do you think? The legend returns. It has been a long time, but I assure you, it's worth the wait. This icon belongs in our lineup. The Land Cruiser returns to its origin with a retro design paired with the legendary capability and durability it's known for. It will take even more customers on adventures as it has done for generations. The all new Land Cruiser sits atop our TNGAF body on frame platform 
that underpins our newest generation of rugged Toyota trucks. And it gets better. Land Cruiser is exclusively powered by our iForce Max turbocharged four-cylinder hybrid powertrain. It produces 326 horsepower and a full 465 pound-feet of torque. It's a true showstopper worthy of this nameplate. This vehicle continues our global beyond zero commitment to reduce carbon emissions by bringing electrification to all. Land Cruiser has been an off-road icon built on the foundation of Toyota's unmatched quality, durability, and reliability. And the Lou Land Cruiser is no different. Every model features full-time full four-wheel drive, a center and rear locking differential, and our new crown crawl control system. We will offer Land Cruiser in three models. Here on my right, is the 1958 model. It pays homage to the first year the Land Cruiser was sold here in the US. It has the awesome round headlamps with the iconic Toyota grille, 18 inch wheels, and LED fog lamps. Here on my left is the Land Cruiser model. This truck reminds me of the FJ62 with its sharp rectangular headlights but it also gets rigid, color-selectable LED fog lamps and an all-new front stabilizer bar disconnect for even more traction in tricky off-road situations, along with multi-terrain select and multi-terrain monitor that displays on a 12.3-inch touchscreen. And for the first few months of production, we're offering a limited-run model we call the first edition. The first edition takes all of Land Cruiser's best features, including the round headlights shown here on the 1958 model, and adds popular equipment like rock rails and a roof rack, all paired with exclusive first edition interior badging. First edition models will be limited to only 5,000 units in the US. Now, I can go on and on about how excited I am about this new Land Cruiser. But I'm most excited to announce that Land Cruiser will now be even more accessible to our customers with a price tag starting in the mid $50,000 range. How about that? Our US-based Calty Design Studio that has been delivering excellence for the last 50 years helped lead the design efforts that resulted in Land Cruiser's amazing new look. And we're able to hear tonight from Kevin Hunter, president of Calty Design, about how the global design team brought Land Cruiser back to its origins. Kevin, please join me. Ladies and gentlemen, Kevin. Right. Thanks, Dave. Appreciate it. Well, hello, everyone. Uh, good evening. Thanks, Dave. Um, first, I have to say, what a true honor to be able to work on this project and be part of a global team to continue the legend that is Land Cruiser. Land Cruiser is a global icon. It has a proven track record of being used under the harshest conditions while giving its occupants supreme confidence that they will safely and reliably return from their trip. Our design team used four key terms to lead the development. Authentic, reliable, timeless, and professional. Now, designing for true purpose has long-lasting universal appeal. And with this in mind, the all-new Land Cruiser is derived from a pure expression of form aligning with function. And we also wanted to go back to the origin of past Land Cruisers to restore the iconic core values while reconnecting to its rugged persona. It was all about conveying a reassuring sense of honesty and authenticity. And the result is a refreshed balance of modern heritage that draws influence from the FJ40 and 70 series Land Cruisers. Now the chisel design, long hood, and upright windshield is a direct link to the 70 series tool-like durability. 
The boxy yet efficient body sits between a wide stance with extended wheel flares to accommodate the large tires, along with a durable over fender for extra protection. While the trapezoid shaped wheel openings look rugged and have effective mud drainage. Now any serious overlander knows having, a, having good outward visibility is essential for a fun and safe journey. So we created a tall cabin with a low belt line to enhance the side look down visibility. The A-pillar is back, while the center hood area is scooped out to provide good forward sight line. The front design components are organized on a grid for easy replacement and customization, while the headlights and radiator grill are mounted high for added protection. And we also beveled the corners to minimize the effect of contact hits while off-roading. Now the 1958 model is a nod to the original Land Cruiser's round headlight charm and offers a blank canvas for accessorizing and customization. And there are also a few old school colors, trail dust and heritage blue, with a two-tone roof that will surely invoke some cool Land Cruiser nostalgia. Now to further enable a fun and safe adventure, we designed the interior experience to convey confidence, security, and intuitive operation. And the interior components are inspired by premium professional tools to express durability and precision. And the horizontal axis instrument panel offers a sense of stability, while operational functions, fu functions are organized in zones for quick access along with smartly designed switches that are easy to operate. And there are also enhanced functional features while driving on rough trails, such as the palm rest for using the center touchscreen and side knee pads that support upright driving posture. Now the collective result is a reborn back to origin Land Cruiser that looks capable, heroic, and lives up to its legendary name. Our creative team loved working on this car. And we have one of our Land Cruiser designers from Calti, Jin Kim, here with us in the audience. Jin. Thank you, everyone. Thanks again for being here. Really appreciate it. What a cool place to, to hold this event. And uh, please enjoy the evening. And I'm going to turn it back to Dave. Thanks, Kevin. Thank you. Kevin, you, your team, the global team from TMC did a truly amazing job. Thank you so much for this great product. And it's important to recognize that we were able to bring Land Cruiser back while still expanding our electrified portfolio. This continues our goal of carbon neutrality. You no longer have to choose between capability and the environment. Land Cruiser rounds out our 25th electrified model across Toyota and Lexus, which is more than any other automaker in the world. I have to say, it is so great to finally share the news that we're bringing the legendary Land Cruiser back, and you won't have to wait much longer. Production will start early next year at the Tahara and Hino plants in Japan, starting with the first edition model. We will announce full pricing and spec details around that time. We can't conclude without giving a huge thank you to Greg Miller and the Land Cruiser Heritage Museum for welcoming us. Greg, thank you so much. <laughs>